Alright, and in today's video, I'm gonna be letting YouTubers decide my base rating loadout. So for your loadout, Heifu, I want you to bring a random set. It just can't be the same piece, and that is basically your challenge. This is the armor that I decided to go with. Like, uh, like no partner items, like zero partner. Motherfucker. Let's see, man. Let's see what you got, godly strafe. Yo, what is going on guys? It is Hayfu here, and in today's video, I'm gonna be letting YouTubers decide my base rating loadout. It's probably gonna be tough on me, but entertaining to watch. With that being said, please leave a like down below, subscribe if you guys are new, and also keep commenting ideas so I don't run out of them, because I love doing these. But yeah, let's not make this intro too long. I hope you guys are gonna enjoy this video. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out. I'm gonna start with Bambi, and let's see what he's got for me. You can only have three pearls, um, no bones. No, actually, three bones and apex a focus modes and combo abilities no time wars no snowballs and you can take beacons okay so summed up this is what he told me three pearls three bones 30 combo abilities 30 focus mode and i guess i'll take some beacons myself okay well let's get on that challenge three pearls man and it's only gonna get worse from here i've heard a sneak peek of the other challenges and they're not looking too hot for me and i don't think bambi thought about it too much but i think i could actually do some damage with these uh items because if i bone him for a long enough time use the combo ability and focus but that leaves me chance to kill him so i actually have a chance here it's not like i'm 100 dying into the base and it's also three high so i actually stand a chance against this guy now let me in bro okay he opened it <gasps> ain't no way dude this guy's fucking quick holy shit dude oh my god no 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 i can't let him get i'm gonna just jump out of the base i'm gonna jump out real quick no 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 please hit me up oh my god i'm good i'm good i'm good i am quite literally out of pearls if i pearl out of here wait that's not good I'm gonna message him to mind me down because if not, I'm gonna have to use a pearl and that means I'm gonna have to run into the base with no pearls, man. Oh, he hit me out of it. Okay, perfect. We're good now. Okay, that's good. Now, he's made most of it too high, but dude, I can't be using these pearls like they're nothing. Oh my god, please. No, I didn't make it in. I'm gonna die now. I guess I rely on pearls a little bit too much. He said drop. You know what? I will just to save my DTR, but yeah, there you go, buddy. Um, am I gonna get, I'm gonna get scummed, aren't I? Oh, he's actually letting me go. Okay, we're lit then. Um, but it's only gonna get harder from here, so I guess I'm gonna have to sit up and actually warm up, man. Okay, time to listen to Dylan's loadout. Hey, hey, foo. I want <laughs> you to run into a base, and I want you to only use Dylan decoys, Dylan daggers, and modifier rotten eggs. Dude, <laughs> it was all good until he said modifier rotten eggs out of nowhere. Like, okay, and I'm gonna keep it a buck with you guys. Nobody uses Dylan Dagger, so I'm actually gonna have to open some crates for that. So uh, let me do that, and I'll bring you guys back when I'm ready with that loadout. Opening your shitty crate. Okay. So guys, I know Dylan is literally right there, bro, Invis. I just seen the particles. Look, he's right there. So he told me that he's gonna follow me to the base that I'm going to, but I just decided, why not run into his base instead? Okay, now that I got the entire loadout, I'm gonna go and pretend like I'm pre potting Invis, and I'm just gonna go down and just straight up run into his base. I know Kraken is online. I know he wasn't team seek, but I don't think he's gonna be able to help here. Come on, dude, I'm gonna go this way, and I kinda want Dylan's bro, Invis, to run out so I can run into his base. Sound oh, you resume. stay like 20 blocks behind him, okay? Oh, shoot. At all times. You just saw me open the door. Yet. Stay there, Nick. Stay there. Don't go out yet. Don't go out there yet. Yeah, don't go out where, Dylan? Don't go out there yet. <laughs> you bitch home, boy. Dude. Where the fuck are you, Dylan? <laughs> dude, you'll never find me. I know how to play this game. Sound muted. Oh my god, there's no fucking way he just egged me into the trap. No! Dude! How am I supposed to. Wait, can I just. I think I'm bro invis right now. That technically counts as a bro invis since I'm invis and it removes armor. And if they check the trap through the inside, then I can invis right in. Oh my god, this is good. Please, please don't lag. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, I could be F-homing right now. Oh shit. Oh god. Okay, well, I think I think Kraken is the one to focus here. I think I can definitely win the 2v1 though. Fuck it. Fuck, this is not good, man. Wait, there's three of them? Are you fucking kidding me? Or is this a different faction? I think it might be a different faction, guys. Wait, I, I hit this guy right here with the dude, they're doing damage though. What the fuck, man? Wait, I'm being, like, focused by, like, two teams. I don't understand, but, dude, I'm gonna fucking die because of Dylan. I hit Kraken. This is Kraken right here. Come on. Big money, dude. Big money. I need to fucking... How can I... Dude, I can't... Oh, this is fucking Zoid. This is fucking Zoid on the staff account. That's what it is. This motherfucker, dude. Look, look at him. Look at him. He's on the fucking staff account. No, motherfuckers. They're all in Team Seek right now. Dude! Oh, my God, bro. Sound reason. You guys are fucking Better. terrible. It's terrible. Hey, you got Colby. snowballed in Abuse. by Abuse. Me, Abuse. I recorded it, Colby. Abuse. <laughs> look, Clout. Oh, you fucking vanished. 
You're fucking lying. Stop stop doing that like he voice at your part. No, he wasn't. Suck a cock. Yes, the entire time. For the record, I really don't care if he was killing me in creative. We're all friends and nobody else besides us was involved. And yeah, I don't really care. Mr. Lambo XD. Alright, I'm gonna be nice since you need it. You need <laughs> it because I'm gonna be nice. Okay, I'll give you three bones, three combo abilities, three apexy, and that's it. He actually made that so easy for me. Thank you, Lambo. Love you, bro. Okay, let's do that. Since Lambo didn't put any limit on anything else besides partner items, I have two stacks of pearls and two invises, so that might be good if I ever need him. But yeah, this faction right here, they're not even enough DTR to go raidable, but I still want to run in because I don't even know why, dude. I just thought they might be bad, but it's actually three high, and I doubt this guy's going to spam butterfly. Oh, wait. I hear somebody else. Oh, he's in diamond. Okay, I'll run in 100%. So I use the combo ability. Please don't go down your drop down, though. That'll be very, very bad. I'm going to focus what on this guy. Come on. Come on. Dude, I killed one. Finally. Fuck, dude. Yes. Okay. This is a spleef. And I'm assuming it's a bowing area. Let's see what this guy had for me. This guy had like snowballs and decos that I could use in this base, but I can't, man. I guess I'll take the pearls, which I don't think I'll need more than two stacks. Bro, that is so funny. Their pet is AFK at the fence gate, so he literally is going to have to kill <laughs> Oh my god, that is so funny. Look, he literally had a full loadout. Oh my god, this is what we're doing, though. This is what we're doing. You're gonna block me up in here? Dude, good luck trying that, man. This this guy's gonna fucking drop. And I just realized that there's wilderness right there because that browser guy is not in the faction and he was digging. And what the fuck? Nope. Nope. <laughs> fuck all that. I'm not doing that, bro. It's a high. I should be able to pro this. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going down there. That is definitely, like, something that leads into, like, a 1x5 and it's a Boeing area or we're just pissed it off. I'm not doing that. Oh, wait. I feel like the fence gate area might lead into the drop down if I'm not. Oh, I think that's what it is. Wait, Loki, that's actually kind of smart. Yo, he just refilled on all those spots. What the fuck? Okay, well, I guess I'm going to have to wait till the combo ability and focus motor off cooldown because this guy's not going to quick drop for sure. And he's going to keep going down this area. And he's going to keep going down that area. And I'm not going down there, bro. Wait, okay, so if I use that elevator that's right there in the spleef, I can get into a one by one. And if I stand on the fence gates, I should be able to win that that gank fight right there. Oh, he's probably up again. Yo, look, look what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go down on purpose. I wanna see what he does as soon as I use the elevator. Okay, come on. He's digging up instead, so I'm gonna have to just cross it, man. Fuck. It's okay though. I sh dude. Dude, don't fail me. Okay, I think that cross should work. He blocked it. No, bro. My pearl didn't work the first time, and now he blocked it. Oh, he, dude, he just came in. Oh, my God, this is good. I don't think he realized that. I don't think he... Wait, this is the other guy. Built different. Well, definitely not because I'm going to fucking kill you. This is the same guy that quick drop whenever I use the partner item. So, let me try it on him again. And what I'm going to do now, focus mode. Come on, dude. He's going to fucking die. Come on. Built different. No, no. I need to stay on him. No, dude. I'm on him. I'm on... Come on, dude. Die. I think he, he might be out of pots. Dude, he's dead. They're one DTR right now. Guys, they're one DTR. No. Wait. Dude, I have no pots. Oh, uh, this is not good, dude. I could pearl. No, 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 no. He's in a one. I could have made that fucking pearl right there. Dude, no. <gasps> this brozo guy. How did he get in? Oh, because he pearled into the spleef. I'm oh, yeah, that's why. Okay, well, you're stuck in there, bro. <gasps> dude, this guy's still trying to do it. No way. Dude, if he. Oh, my God. This is perfect, guys. He's going to make this a one by one. Dude, no, no. Can I bone him? I can't. Zero seconds. You got to be kidding me. Guys, there's zero online now. He logged out. I guess I'll left home. I take that as a W because I made him log out. They were 30 TR originally. That's crazy, though. And this is the Mesoid loadout. Let's do half P2, half P1, no custom min chance. I'm thinking we get a fire res pot, three speeds, two invis, Dude. a row of pots, a sharp one, wooden sword, um, what? a stack of pearls, and let's get some combo abilities, focus modes, bones, anti-trap beacons, you know, the usual partner packages load up, but make sure you got that sharp one wooden sword. Bro, what is wrong with this guy? This guy made me do it. I literally had to go get a bunch of spawners. I had to get a full enchanter. I got a sharp one on breaking three wooden sword. I put on breaking three on it so it doesn't break. And then I got, you know, all the full set, P1. And this is going to suck, man. I don't want to half ass it and go to a base that I know I'll die in. So I'm running over here where people, you know, that get in late of SOTW claim. And I'm actually going to try to make somebody rateable. Hopefully they're like an iron or something. But it's honestly not that bad. A regular sharp two diamond sword does like 9.75 or something. I thought it would be like plus two damage but it does 5.25 attack damage which is pretty bad but it's not as bad as i thought it was i literally forgot to bring a pickaxe but it's okay oh i should not hold out the wood sword but i think i'm gonna run into this base this guy looks like he knows what he's doing but he dropped me an axe oh, oh fuck no he probably has a trap in the front i'll run in man unless don't pull your trap <gasps> uh oh okay there's people but it's okay I'm, I'm running in i don't think i do damage right i'm not gonna do damage at all and my durability is breaking already no wait i need to pot i need oh dude i need to pot speed bro this is already going really bad. Um, fuck. I, I mean, I need to use the partner items to my advantage, really. That's what I need to do. 
Come on, he has to go out. He literally has to go out. And then, dude, I actually have a chance if I use the combo ability. But you know what? I need to be smart about... Oh, shit. He knows how to use the beacons. Or he knows how to break them. I need to be very smart about this and get all my hits in. If I can't kill him right here, he's he's, he's going to get out. Yep, he's, he's out. I can't do this. Dude, I'm done. How does he know it's me? I don't... Does the beacon tell you the name? I don't know, but I'm turning all of this into bone meal. I'm gonna die anyway, so I'm just taking it like a man, dude. Fuck it. I'm dead. Well, that sucks. Melanite has a pretty long message, so let's see what he has to say. So for your loadout, Heifu, I want you to bring a random set, and what I mean by that is that you cannot wear a diamond helmet and a diamond chest plate at the same time. It can't be the same pieces, so you can wear a diamond helmet, a leather chest plate, gold boots, and basically, I guess, uh, chainmail leggings. It just can't be the same piece, and that is basically your challenge. It's up to you how many pearls you want to bring, how many partner items. This challenge is hard enough already, so that is up to you, Heifu, and good luck to you, and hopefully you can make some people rateable with this loadout <laughs> oh my god well that's another instant death loadout but i guess i gotta do it this is the armor that i decided to go with and if you look at the bottom of your screen honestly it's not that bad 2.5 armor things off it's not that bad honestly and i have all these partner items to help me like take damage and all that stuff but yeah if this guy isn't lying then i actually have a chance to make him rateable because he has three pots according to what he said okay man let's see uh you're gonna let me in oh he's opening it he opened it all He's, he's gonna really try blocking. No fucking way. I'm so like that reaction time is fucking crazy And I'm not taking that much damage, dude. I'm really not I can't believe I just did that with only a combo ability and I barely got the strength as well Bro, this is this wait. There's a full limit up there. By the way, I'm not fucking stupid I see you I see you but I'm letting him go. That is just crazy to me I fully expected to die when I came over to this base, but that's wow. I'm a foaming actually change of plans Let's listen to the next loadout and it's from resucting Okay, raid a base with only pearl blocks and time warps. Well, that's an unusual loadout. I pearl block puts you on pearl cooldown if you hit somebody, and it also gives them resistance one. And the time warp involves pearl. I guess they both involve pearls, so that's pretty cool. All right, let's do it. Look, don't ask me why, but I'm weird, and I think that whenever I bring two stacks of pearls, I somehow mess it up, and I don't make the people raidable. So I only brought one this time, even though I have plenty of space to bring two. And I'm gonna run in and hopefully make this guy raidable. So if I miss, actually, dude, it's kind of stupid. I should have brought two stacks because if I miss a pearl, I have the time warps for that. Fuck. I just realized this base is open, by the way. You can pretty much stall right there. Dude, it's like open at the, I don't know if it's double layered at the top, but at least like one layer is open. Like it's it's gonna be three high. I'm sticking him though. I'm, like, I'm going fucking stupid. Oh no, he just fucking flew like, oh no, it's double layered. Well, honestly, pro blocks are not gonna be very useful unless I'm in a huge base, like a glass box, because that stops them from proling away of the like refilling. But this guy just, dude, I don't know why my pro didn't work. But yeah, the only way pro blocks are gonna be useful is if I, nope, I'm gonna die. Well, I'm being crit out. I don't know this guy's like trying to slab me from very far away. What's this gonna do for me? Nothing. I could always time warp if I need to. I messaged the guy, come on now. He said, okay. I don't know what he took that as, but hopefully he minds me out. I think he's giving me a second try because that was kind of boring. Are we just going? Okay, we're going. We're doing it. Dude, if he goes into a corner, I want to I want to try that pearl again. Oh my god. Very small area right now. That's good. Dude, I, I need to let him block up in there. I need to let him block up in that one by one over there. No, no, no. Not on this side. Not on this side at all. Come on. I'm going to time warp. And no, dude, it might be a one by one. I'm in. Holy shit. Holy fuck. He just mined out of his base too. Dude, this guy is fucking panicking right now. I can tell. No. Motherfucker, he got out. No, he went down to refill. Man, okay. There's a chance this elevator goes... Nope, it's not gonna go outside. I'm in. Come on. Bro, he made it a, such a small area right now. No, he's just... Dude, he just keeps on digging out whenever he gets in a, a sticky situation. But I can just stick through this, even though he kind of refilled already. I'm going fucking crazy on... Dude, if I had a strength 2 item, this guy would have been dead for sure. Like a long time ago, man. I want him to block up in that corner. He just keeps on going the other way, though. Dude, it's so annoying. No! Dude, that would have been so cool if I made a pearl into a one by one with him. Man, I bet you he's hearts low right now. He said half a heart. You're capping. You're fucking lying. Oh my god, dude. This guy got so lucky. He said no pots. That's cap, bro. That's fucking cap. Dude, no. <laughs> I had a second chance right there to do it. Fuck, man. I mean, holy sh- No, dude. Fuck, that sucks. There's no way I'm gonna be able to pull this off. Dude, no. I'm dead. Dude, I'm making him think that I'm spamming my pearl at the slab, but little does he know, I'm at homing. Dude, one second, <gasps> and I got out. Let's go. I'm gonna count that because I was in that base for quite a while, and I used the time warps, which is part of the loadout. So, let's hear who's up next. Like, everything except, like, uh, like no partner items. Like, zero partner Motherfucker. Item. Yeah. 
Oh my goodness gracious. All right. Well, low key, that's a little sneak peek of the next video because I'm going to be, um, I'll, I'll just leave it at that. Just let's get into it. Sadly, I can't make this guy rateable though, but he is willing to F home, which I think it's total BS, but we'll see if it is true. These are the type of bases that I like to see, man. 3x3 three three drop down, a regular base. I feel like it's uneven though. I don't know. Something's triggering my OCD here. So never mind. This is the base that he's letting in from. And I, I had some hope right there, but I guess not. It is what it is, man. The whole point of me running into bases with no partner items, it's to be a challenge. It's not supposed to be me going to like easy bases and giving a free raid. It's supposed to be these two high bases with no partner items. Let's see, man. Let's see what you got. Godly strafe. Are you really that godly? Oh, he blocked a drop down. Worst mistake ever. He went up. No, no, don't block. Dude, if he breaks a... Wait, oh, I could have made that pro. Fuck. Kind of letting him block up right there because I, I know he's going to go for the bottom block, but actually I'm going to... Be pushing to the drop down if I do that. Oh no, he had it blocked still. If anything, I want to stay against defense gate, so I'm gonna pro there. I'm trying to slab me from over there. But I think Oh, I can't cross pro it. Nice. <gasps> he mined it, he mined it. Oh, he was a nice guy. I said come on, and he mined it, and I, I got out. But okay, I think I'm in a better area. I'm in. Please don't have that many pots, dude. I'll be so pissed. Okay, I can stick this. I can stick this long ass too high tunnel. Come on. I can't, I can't. I'm I pearled in. Holy shit, that pearl was crazy. Okay, I need to stick him now. If I get in his body, he won't be able to mine any blocks, and I can actually drain him his whole inventory. No, I can't let him mine any more blocks now. Dude, I think he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. Holy shit, dude, that was crazy. He had P1. It's okay, though. I'm gonna PvP revive him, see if he wants to come back. He can, but I think I'll die if he comes back and traps me again. I offered him his P2 setback because he kind of did mine me out, and I feel bad for him, but he didn't want it. He refused. I guess he doesn't trust me, or he just doesn't want it. Hit the like button if you want a part two, and subscribe to the channel if you enjoy content like this. But that's going to be it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.